Hi ladies, welcome back to another YouTube video. For today's video, we are going to be talking about what's on my work desk, little like trinkets and just ways to make your desk feel like home, away from home. And this is coming at a really interesting time for me because I am actually going to be switching roles in my job. Uh, my The company that I work for, uh, part of the company was acquired by another company and I'm actually going to be moving over with that company which is going to be an exciting opportunity but definitely lots of changes so I'm actually moving desks and so to be honest I'm going from a space where I have lots of natural light and beautiful windows to a space where I will have no windows so <laughs> I'm going to be looking for ways to just make it really interesting and maybe I'll post an update on that but before I packed up my desk today I just wanted to show what's on my desk and just some cute ways to decorate your desk because at the end of the day like it or not for those of us that do work in an office it is where we spend majority of our time during the week and I don't know, I just feel like it's important to make it feel comfortable. Obviously not too comfortable, like sometimes I think it's kind of not so great when people have too many pictures. It needs to be professional, but you can make it kind of chic in your own. And by the way, I work in marketing in a for a fashion retail company in New York City. And I absolutely love my job, I love what I do. And I am able to dress very casually, as you can tell, for work, which is great. So. This, I guess, maybe would apply to those in a less formal office. I don't know what the rules are if you are a lawyer or someone that works in finance or something else. But I would say that in general, these are just some things that you can keep on your desk. And I think that they are really cute and I love this topic. So, <laughs> without further ado, let's get into the video. By the way, the background that you see here is actually my desk at home. This is in my bedroom. This is just my own personal space. But I will insert a clip here of me at my office at work. You can see that it is different, very office-y, 9 to 5, fun stuff. <laughs> okay, so starting with my favorite, I have this Kate Spade kind of office collection. And it is a stapler and masking tape that are in these acrylic and gold. So... The stapler says keep it together on the top and then the tape says make it stick. So these are just really, really cute. When I saw these a couple years ago when I first started my job here, I was so excited. I was like, I need them. They're a little pricey, but I think they've gone down. And I think there are actually dupes of them on, on Amazon. If I can find them, I'll leave a link down to them down below. But these are just adorable and they look so cute on my desk and especially atop my acrylic monitor stand and I really like that piece just because I feel like it's great to like put your monitor up higher because I don't know for me I kind of like to be looking up a little bit I don't want to be like straining my neck looking down on a computer I need to be like up like this so I like to raise my monitor up in a previous job that I had before this one the monitors were actually like attached so you know in most cases actually you probably won't need a monitor stand but in the case that you do I found this really cute perfect acrylic one that I will also leave linked down below uh, again anything that I can link I will link down below so before I say, say, say that a million times but yes I think I just love the acrylic look because it is very clean it's very chic it's also this one is great because you can push your keyboard and mouse under it at the end of the day and then when you leave, you just have this great space. It's also perfect for clearing your desk out of the way when you want to eat your lunch. So I just really love that. And I love leaving my desk at the end of the night just looking perfectly clean and everything is in its place. I know not, not everyone is like that, but before I leave my desk every day, I just make sure that everything is in the right place. <sighs> That's just how I am. <laughs> Next are two pens. And I know that this seems so unimportant but i think having a cute pen it just makes your it makes your day it makes you so happy when you have to write with it so i have this one that i actually got at the museum of ice cream and i absolutely love it it writes in pink also which is just amazing and it has this cute little puffball on the top and i just thought this would be so cute i love writing my little notes with this 
And then the other one that I got, uh, actually when I was in New Orleans with some friends, this has nothing to do with New Orleans, but I just saw it at a gift shop and I had to have it. It has a little diamond at the top, which I think is gorgeous, very glam, very chic. And it's also rose gold, so very pretty. And it's so cute. And I have these sitting inside of my cup. So <laughs> you'll notice that this this is a cute mug. This is an anthropology mug. I love this mug. A lot of girls, this was, actually this was not my idea. A lot of girls have gotten these anthropology mugs with their initial on it and they put their pens and pencils and everything else in it. So I did that. <laughs> these days maybe I would find something a little bit cuter but I do think that this still looks very chic. I have lots of different little pens and pencils in it. I have my pink scissors, which actually, you don't think that you would need scissors sitting at a desk, but randomly you do. Scissors and tape and a stapler, like the elementary basics, you actually do need. So, or if you're the only one that has them, people will always be asking to use yours. So it's just good to have them. But <laughs> you'll notice what's interesting about this is that it has some pens and pencils in it, but it's mostly just like Glossier products. <laughs> Priorities, I know. <laughs> but you'll see I have like a cloud paint right here, some of the bomb.com. I have a little Glossier U sample, the eyeshadows. I have a halo scope, another cloud paint, and the list goes on. So, you know. I think it looks all cute in there and when I'm at my desk, if I'm about to go to, into an important meeting, I will just, you know, freshen up a little bit or if I have a hot date after work, you know, that never really happens anymore because um, I have a boyfriend, but... <laughs> But yeah, sometimes you have an event after work and if you forget to bring your makeup with you or say if you and your coworkers decide to go somewhere after work and you weren't planning on it, I always feel like it's nice to keep a little bit of makeup in your desk. So I have just a few little touch up products from Glossier in here. And then in my desk, I do also keep just like a random brush. This actually really does come in handy, but just like any brush, I just picked this up at the drugstore. It's from Conair. I have a miniature mirror and this was actually not really my idea. I saw a lot of other girls that I worked with have some sort of a miniature mirror on their desk because A, you can use it to touch up your face, but then B, you can use it as a reflector to see who's coming up behind you. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't actually keep mine on my desk all the time. I keep mine in my drawer because I'm not like, I don't want to be obnoxious like that. <laughs> but anyways, but when I am doing my makeup, I will just pull out my little mirror and I'll just do it quickly and then I'll put it back in my drawer. So yes, that is that. And then I also keep some hair ties because I just found that I would be wearing my hair down to work and then I would accidentally like... I don't know, maybe it was a windy day or it was rainy and I just don't like the way that my hair looks down anymore and I want to put it up and I forgot to bring a hair tie with me. So I always just keep hair ties in my desk. These are the No Slip Grip from Scoon Scunchy, Scoonchy. I've actually never known how to pronounce this, but you know the brand that's in every single drugstore, just like the blonde, thinner ones. And then, <laughs> if this isn't already the most girly desk haul already, it's about to get more girly. I keep the Glossier Soothing Face Mist in my desk because what I always say to everyone I work with is that at 3 p.m. we mist. So at 3 p.m. ish, that's when the day is getting, you know, like, oh, okay, I'm like, I'm done, I'm exhausted, I'm ready to go home. At 3 p.m. I pull out my Glossier Soothing Face Mist and I refresh myself and then I pull myself together and I keep working. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I really do just like miss myself at my desk and it's amazing. All right, next is a notebook and I love this one from, the brand is just Fringe, but I picked it up at Staples. It says, in my own world in cursive on the front and it has the gold uh, bind and then the gold at the end of the pages. I love stuff like that. I actually am someone who ooh, is very digital and I keep all of my notes in OneNote on my laptop. So I don't even need a notebook, but in the case that I'm ever presenting something off of my laptop and I can't take notes, 
I will sometimes bring a notebook to a meeting just so that if I do need to write down follow-ups or any key takeaways, I have the option to do that. So I would bring this to the meeting and just go to town taking notes. The next thing that I have is a calendar and this is also from Kate Spade. This is just a cute little calendar where it has the month. Right now we're in October. And then when October ends, I just pull it off and start the new month. And they always have a cute little, like, almost like word of the month on the back. So usually I don't look at this until the month is over, but I'll look at it now just in case. It says, Couthy, C-O-U-T-H-Y. Tell me if I'm pronouncing that wrong in the comments. It's an adjective. It says, warm and friendly, as in a person, or cozy and comfortable, as in a place. So I really like that actually. I feel like that's a good one for October too. Things, you know, start to get a little bit more cozy. All right, next is a coaster. And I have this really cute one from Anthropology. It's like a purple and pink marble, I guess, or I'm actually not sure what stone this is. I thought that it was marble, but I'm not 100% sure and it has the gold trim around the edge. And so I just put this on my desk, this is great. A lot of uh, businesses actually like when people use coasters, just you know, your coffee mug or your water or whatever you're drinking, it's just nice to put it down on something. And so I was like, well, if I have to do that, then I want a pretty one. <laughs> so I got this in Anthropology. It was maybe $14 in the sales section. So, I mean, it's pretty nice. I mean, maybe $14 for one coaster is a little bit much, but it's pretty and it's on my desk where I spend all my time. That's kind of what I try to, like how I rationalize with things on my desk, i.e. a $30 stapler, because... <laughs> Again, your office is where you spend all your time, so you want to make it, you want it to be happy because sometimes being at work sucks and when you have your beautiful things surrounding you, it just makes you happier. So it's an investment in your future. <laughs> Next thing I have here are a pair of shoes and what a lot of girls do in New York or in any office ever is keep shoes in their desk. And I'm not someone who has practically their whole closet under their desk. You know who you are if you're watching this. And you have a million shoes under your desk. I actually don't do that because I feel like well, what if I want to wear them on the weekends or whatever. So I keep one neutral pointy toe pair under my desk and these are basically my work shoes because these go with pretty much any outfit and that was kind of my idea whether it's summer fall winter spring no matter if I'm wearing pants jeans skirts dresses I can pretty much wear a nude pointy toe flat so these ones are from and other stories they still they still sell them they're very classic and yeah so yes shoes under the desk it is a real thing and then the next thing that I have <laughs> is a blanket. And I think it's so funny the, the concept of keeping a blanket on your desk, but most offices get freezing cold. And when I say freezing, I mean, it's like in the summer, it's really hot outside and then they blast the AC inside. And then in the winter, it's never warm enough with the heat. So, <sighs> We just have to protect ourselves and and bring a blanket and i have this one i love it it is again just from amazon it's a pink wool with little frills and you know a lot of people actually do keep a blanket on their desk and they'll just put it over their shoulders i don't like sitting there looking like i have a blanket on like i'm at home like curling up under my covers i just feel uncomfortable so what I do is I'll just put it on my legs, just under my desk, and I have a little blanket on and I'm warm and cozy, but but yeah, up to you. But this is a good one, and I think keeping a blanket on your desk is always a good idea. All right, next I have a couple of new things I'm actually going to be putting on my new desk. And also, again, from this Kate Spade kind of gold collection. They are some bow paper clips. And I just think that these are so cute. If you have to be paper clipping things, then do it in style. <laughs> and 
and yeah I just really like these I think that they're really cute when I was an intern back in 2013 and I was working at a small catalog retail company up in New Hampshire I um, my boss back then had really cool very chic paper clips and I was like well why do you have chic paper clips and it's because we used to work with these magazine editors and anytime she needed to give something to them she like wanted it on something chic and I'm like oh that's so like I would never think about that but I mean yeah I just think that it's fun and why not I guess why not the next thing that I have here is also on the newer side for me again from Kate Spade and that is just kind of like a plethora of office supplies so we have some sticky notes with a cute little drawn on gold paper clip there some more paper paper clips these are shaped swirly i have these fun magnets a little gold pencil sharpener because again why not some more pretty pens these large and medium and small gator clips some more sticky notes and push pins so yeah just in general a really cute a cute little combination of things just to have on your desk and then I also got an acrylic pencil cup just to make everything match and this again is from Kate Spade it is the same exact theme as my stapler my and my tape and this one is says a stroke of genius of course to genius <laughs> but yes I love this I'm going to be putting all of my pens and pencils in here so 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 cute and then the next thing that I got was this Kate Spade acrylic business card holder and this again is the same little theme the gold and the acrylic it just looks like this and you put business cards in here I actually it looks like a little um, envelope and this one says call me <laughs> it's hard to show because it's like clear in the window but I think that you can see what it looks like I actually don't have any business cards my company doesn't do business cards anymore just because it's kind of gone away and although they are very helpful I think for events and conferences we just don't have them, so until something changes, I will be putting the business cards that I get from everyone else in this <laughs> little holder. And then the last thing that I have is this Molten Brown Delicious Rhubarb and Rose Body Lotion. I absolutely love this scent. It, it smells so good. Every time I put this on, it's very strong too. When I put it on, people are like, oh, you put the lotion on. Uh, but... <laughs> But it does smell very, very good, and especially going into winter, you know, your hands just get so dry, so it's great when you get in from the commute to just put in some lotion, rub it on your hands, and your hands will not get as dry in the winter. So, yes, I have some hand lotion on my desk. I love that this is also the pump, too, so I can just very quickly use it and get the product that I need. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. It really means a lot to me and I'm so glad that you're here. Please feel free to subscribe if you like this video and you want to see more. Also leave it a comment, hit the bell, like it, all of those fun things. And then I also have an Instagram account called The Fashion Squirrel and I post daily outfit inspiration on there and lots of cute fun photos and Insta stories. So definitely feel free to check that out as well. And other than that, I will see you guys next time. All right. Bye.